I am bit still a bit confused on the Excel version. Where do I see the calls coming from the system? You don't uh, see anything. Uh, what happens in the background? In the background, the program is done in such a way that it will just give you dump by by call option by put option. That's as simple as that. You it won't <coughs> even ask you to think. As soon as it turns green and the number comes to one two double five, you buy an futures contract. That is how simple it is. You don't need any technical analysis or whatever uh, extra knowledge uh, that you have. And uh, as far as the data is concerned, the data comes from various sources. <coughs> you get the NSE uh, option data from the NSE server. So we don't use anything from your uh, Odin or any other external uh, data sources. And uh, the data refreshes every three seconds. The reason why you see the flicker <coughs> flicker on the screen is uh, because the whole uh, complete application re refreshes every three seconds. So that is why you see that flicker. And uh, since it is transmitted from my system to your system, the bandwidth and all these things put together, you get that flicker. But otherwise. If it is installed on your own system, on your own desktop, you don't get the flicker. <coughs> and in fact, you can even uh, check this also. The NSE uh, server, what Java applet, what we have here. This refreshes late. What we have is, <coughs> I'm sorry. What we get here is <coughs> very flat three seconds. And three seconds, everything refreshes. The prices, the options. So you can just go check uh, what is uh, SBI, uh, the current option, the current option price of SBI for a put call at uh, 1800. So it's 3401 here. It will be something near to that there in uh, your terminal also. So you can see 34.55 here. So it's around between 34.01 and 34.68. Because now it's trading at 18.24.90. And here uh, the target is 18.24. It's somewhere between that. So your option prices are right. You don't get any pop-up in uh, option tree. As soon as you, are, uh, you get a call, if it is a sell call or it, uh, it is a uh, put option, the red color gets activated. So you just click on the put button and then your uh, trade is placed. And in case if there is a buy call, this buy and this 6322 turns green. Maybe all our uh, sell calls today. In case if we get a buy call, uh, you can see it here.
That I will uh, give you the pricing once you come on Facebook. Please send me a request. I will send you the complete details. Now this is one uh, classic example of uh, auto trades. Like what will happen in case if uh, a person would have taken this call? <coughs> a buy call here and immediately sell call here. So that is uh, 277 minus 287. That is 10 rupees is nothing but uh, 10,000 rupees in coal India. So a complete loss. And he is still waiting for a buy call. Got a sell call here, and then it's supposed to get that buy call till that time it won't uh, activate. So this 10,000 loss here, and again from here to here, again 10, 20,000 rupees loss in this trade. Whereas in case if I mean, uh, a human intervention was there, you know that there is uh, a CCI uh, fine on uh, coal India. So it was supposed to be a gap down. You just wait till uh, you finish that candle and then wait and take the call. <coughs> because it's at 9.20 we had this. It's at 3.30. So anyone having <coughs> doubts, please uh, type your questions in the chat box. We have another half an hour. After that, uh, we'll just uh, wind up this. Maybe whatever is the, is the results later, I'll just post it on YouTube.
there is nothing like <coughs> a risk and a reward ratio here. Uh, risk that depends on the kind of stop loss what you want to put. The reward what you are seeing is in terms of percentage here. SBI has made uh, from entry to uh, intermediate target, your uh, reward is 7.4% on your investment. Risk, whatever you put it as the stop loss, that will be a risk. It's very clearly de defined here in terms of percentage, in terms of money itself. 